I'm Landon Norris and I'm a McLaren Formula One racing driver. It's actually one of the most difficult things to describe you know, what it's like to actually drive the Formula One car because it's so unique, it's so different to anything else in the world. The speed and the adrenaline is something which you basically never feel in, in anything else but driving a Formula One car. There's a lot of technology around a Formula One car more than any other category of, of racing or any other type of race car. There's like over 300 sensors on a Formula One car, which is constantly going backwards and forwards to the, to the pits, to my car, and also all the way back to MTC back in, in the UK. And then there's also things that, that are coming up on my steering wheel, revs, gears, fuel, energy, all things which I'm having to calculate and, and read and adapt to during the race. Splunk have a really exciting relationship with McLaren, with the Formula One team and the eSports team. We've been with them uh, a few years and seeing them go from success to success, it's been an amazing last few years. On a race weekend, uh, the telemetry that's provided by the, the cars is you know, streamed back to working into mission control. It's an amazing location, 32 race engineers sat there in calm, cool conditions to go and make those decisions. The thing that Splunk provides for McLaren Formula One on the race weekend is ensuring all of that telemetry is taken from the car and arrives back at McLaren Racing. Every single race there's feedback and, and data which uh, I'm getting or the team are getting which will change every outcome. As a driver, there's obviously a lot of things you can look at, but if you want to just simply go out and go quicker, which is our job, is, um, is looking at these simple things, like turning the car, throttle and brake. Like those three things are the biggest bits of data that we can use as a driver. One of the most important areas that we're working with drivers is the new era of esports. So the actual, the electronic gaming side. So one area that we're sponsoring is the McLaren Shadow Esports team and the F1 game from Codemasters produce the, the same, actually more telemetry than a real F1 car. So they're not bounded by physics. So I can tell every tire what surface it's on, the inside, the outside uh, G-forces on it, the pressures, lateral, longitudinal G-force, all of those type of things. So we can actually then go and take all of that telemetry. We can experiment with different ways of displaying that information to drivers. They can start to use that for driver selection, car improvement, and go and make that a really engaging race. We're now looking to see what we can now do for McLaren Racing in the Formula One side to go and bring that experience to their drivers. When we started the relationship with McLaren and started working with them, I thought it was about the data itself and being able to get the, the best decision possible, you know, all this advanced AI and ML, that was going to be the future. The more I've got to know McLaren and Formula One, it's about using data to go and give the person with the most amount of knowledge access to data and context to make a decision. On a race weekend, you may have um, someone who's an aerodynamic expert gets a, sees a piece of data sat on race weekend in mission control, uh, which is in Woking in the headquarters, who makes a decision to change something on the car, to come into the pits, to change some tactics, and they have full authority and autonomy to go and make that decision. The person on the pit wall is just relaying that information to the driver. That's what data really means to McLaren. There's so many things that a, a good Formula One team needs in order to be the best. It's not just who can have the best drivers or who can run the team in the best way. You know, there's so many parts of the structure of a Formula One team that has to be good. And a lot of that nowadays is technology based and, and data driven. So the more we can advance in every area of a Formula One team from the drivers and so on, um, the better and more competitive we're going to be.